Hey guys, it's Shell. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to our news. So today's video is going to be a grocery haul. You guys have expressed interest in wanting to see what I eat in a day's grocery hauls, meal prep videos, things like that on this channel. So all of the meal prep videos that I was doing on my main channel are now going to be here. And I will start doing what I eat in a day's and all of that kind of stuff. If you guys like these grocery hauls, I will keep doing them. If not, I'm still kind of in this limbo place of like where I should put them and even if I should continue to film them because I personally don't watch grocery hauls. But again, if you guys are interested and in showing interest, I have no problem whatsoever continuing to film them and upload them. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this grocery haul. This grocery haul was a Walmart grocery delivery, which I am obsessed with. I pay a monthly fee for them to just deliver whatever I whatever they can to me like whatever I need like literally it has been life changing and yes you have to tip them every time they come to their house to your house but I literally have a delivery come to my house like two to three times a week not even kidding so this was a this was a haul just to kind of like replenish staples like um things like fruit and vegetables milk things like that but then I also kind of talk about things that I've been craving and whatnot, so without further ado, I'm gonna stop rambling and we're gonna go ahead and get into the haul. Okay, so here we go with our grocery haul. This is just for one week, and this is, I did a really large grocery haul last week, and if you wanna see that, it, I think it's up on my main channel. I'm not sure, but it's, it's somewhere, and I'll link it down below. But that one was really large. This one was just to replenish staples that I needed and then also get things that I was craving. So here's the kids' bread. They Well, this is the one that they like the most. So I went ahead and I got another one for them because they're getting low. Um, these are only 88 cents and they're really great to freeze because a lot of times I'm like, oh, I want hamburgers and I don't have hamburger buns on hand. And me and the kids are not the biggest fan of using <laughs> bread as buns. So I really bought this because one is 88 cents and two, you can easily freeze them. So those are actually, we are just going to pop in the freezer real quick and call it a day. So that way, if we ever want a burger, we have hamburger buns on hand if we don't have them in the pantry. Okay, and Cantrell was begging for these. And I was trying to tell him, like, they're good, but it's not like... They're, oh my gosh, so good, so crazy over. They just look really pretty. <laughs> so anyways, I'm going to freeze one of these as well and then have one, put one in the pantry because, again, I've made, I made burgers in my last meal prep and we are still eating off of those and we've been kind of craving those. For some reason, I've been craving a lot of beef lately and not chicken. I don't know if it's because I've been eating so much chicken or what, but... Anyways, over here I just got some cherry tomatoes, some of these little oat potatoes. The kids don't like potatoes. Like, I mean, they like them if I cut them up and put them in the oven, but I very rarely do it that way. So, and I've been craving a baked potato. So if I buy a whole bag of potatoes, they normally go bad. So here I am just having three of those. They're lined in plastic. You just put them in the microwave and they literally taste oven baked. They're so delicious. So I ordered two of the bigger things of strawberries. I think it's like two pounds, but they were out of stock of those. So I got four. Speaking of out of stock, I also got some ice cream cup. I'm so upset because they were out of stock of that too. And I love to have that little sweet treat at the end of the night because I don't know, it just makes me feel good and it, it tastes good and I like to have that little bit of sweet treat so now I'm gonna have to find something else anyways four packs of strawberries they smell insanely delicious I cannot wait to dig into those this morning for breakfast again this is like something I'm I normally do not crave and I don't know why I think it's because I got this parmesan hold on what is it garlic parmesan basil butter and I put it on a steak last week that I guess I was craving more steaks again, but I also wasn't craving a steak that was like chewy and I wanted something that was tender. So I got two things of filet mignon. Again, I never, ever, ever do this, especially with that price, but I decided to treat myself and I'm sure the kids will. Ava has been loving steaks. Whenever I make steaks, which again is very rare, but when I do, 
she tears them up and she gets so upset when they're gone. So I really got that for me and her. Kinchella will probably eat something else that night. Or he can eat a steak too. Um, I got some milk for the kids. I got some pico de gallo. I don't know how fresh that's looking. I guess it looks okay. Um, I got four. Oh, I got eight Chobani flips. Four of the peanut butter cup. Four of the mint chocolate chip. I got some red seedless grapes. The kids and I have been loving grapes lately. Um, no, I don't freeze them. No, I don't want to try them because I don't like cold stuff like that. I don't think I would like them. Um, I also don't like frozen, frozen, what's it called? I don't like frozen fruit. Got some cherries. They are so dang good. Got two packages of lean ground beef. We can do so much with this. We can make taco meat. We can make meatloaf, burgers, something else, love. These are another new obsession of mine. Um, I just adore these. These are so convenient and they taste really yummy too. My favorite so far is the mango, but here I've got mango, peach, and then strawberry banana. And they're just Chobani um, yogurts. They're Greek yogurt and it's a, it's a liquid, like it's a drink. So I don't know if this is zooming or focusing, but it's 140 calories, four grams of fat, 18 carbs and 10 grams of protein. So this is something really convenient. Grab on the go. Uh, if you need like a little snack, a little protein boost, love those so much. Highly recommend them. Um, I also got these two. I was looking for some frozen cooked chicken. Like I really wanted some chicken breast, but I couldn't find that. This was the closest I could find to it. So it's the Tyson grilled and ready chicken strips and hopefully they taste good. Uh, Kentrell, he drinks coffee, so he said he was out of creamer, so I got him some vanilla, French vanilla creamer. I don't know if I said this already, got some whipped cream. Me and Ava love whipped cream. Kentrell doesn't like whipped cream. Um, I've been trying to eat more salads lately, so I got some green leaf lettuce. I had to replenish that because I still have some left over. I have spinach in the, in the fridge because, not gonna lie, I don't eat that as much as I do the, this. But anyways, um, got a cucumber as well. I've never gotten these. Every time I've ordered them, they've always been out of stock. So hopefully I like them. They're just the Bob Evans sour cream and chives mashed potatoes. Again, the kids don't like mashed potatoes, so that will all be for me um, to go with my steak. Unless I eat a baked potato, which I think I'm probably going to eat a baked potato because I'm really craving that. I was thinking this actually wasn't going to be in stock. So I'll probably make this with something else. Um, and then I just got two containers of blueberries and that's everything right here on the island. And then back here, I just got this little M&M, uh, mini M&M container. Um, we eat um, these little, me and Ava make these little energy balls and we love them and we are obsessed with them. And they, um, I made them last time with mini M&Ms and oh my gosh, what a difference. They are so good. So I wanted to go ahead and get them again and make them again. Um, she mentioned, my daughter um, mentioned something about Pocky. So I went ahead and I got the kids some Pocky as a treat. So I got three cookies and cream, two strawberry, one dark chocolate. Well, it just says chocolate. Um, I actually ordered two of these so it could be two of each, but they were out of this. So they gave me cookies and cream, which is good because I think that's well, I think this is Ava's favorite. This is Kentrell's favorite. So, oopsie. Probably should have did three and three. Anyways, these right here were a substitution, which I was so upset about. I was I specifically got the late late July brand because they have the best um, lime tortilla chips. Like lime. I was, why am I trying to say scented? Um, they have like a hint of lime in them and they're so good because it's not overwhelming and it's a really good lime taste. So I ordered two of those, but they were out. So they just sent me the sea salt thin and crispy, which is why I got a bag because I ordered these with the hint of lemon or hint of lime. And then those right there, I ordered two balance out if you didn't want a little hint of lime you can have regular so I don't even need those because I have two bags now I have three bags of regular regular tortilla chips and I'm kind of sad so that's everything with this haul um, like I said I did a really large haul last week so this week I just needed to replenish the staples 
and get what I was craving, which was those um, filet mignons and some ground beef. Also, I'm very sad because they didn't have my ice cream, so I might have to venture out. We legit have been staying home, you guys. Like, we have not been going out anywhere because Georgia numbers are just skyrocketing like crazy. Um, but I might have to venture out. We will see. Um, if not, we can we can always wait till next week. So, yeah, that's our haul. So that will do it for this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you did, you know what to do. Go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel if you are new here. Love you guys, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.